Well, not everyone who is a millionaire was born with a silver spoon. Studies show that 86% of millionaires attested to the fact that they made their wealth. They didn't inherit it. Also, current projections are that 1,700 new U.S. millionaires are made every day. So, you may ask, what is the common reason behind the success of these self-made millionaires? In this video, I will share with you the 5 most overlooked habits self-made millionaires share. 1. Lifelong Learners Your brain is your greatest asset and it ought to be polished as often as possible. Many individuals believe that education starts and ends at school. But the truth is that self-education cannot be overemphasized. So, keep expanding your knowledge. Attaining financial success in the first place requires plenty of education. The individual in question does not only need to learn their trade but also follow industry leaders and keep themselves up to date on relevant news. Although people barely count education as one of the bases of self-made millionaires' success, it is paramount. Self-made millionaires invest money and time in various forms of learning, such as coaching, online courses, physical meetups, and conferences. Also, according to Tom Corley, 85% of self-made millionaires read at least two books each month. Not only do these men and women read, but their choice of reading material is also strategic. They read biographies of successful people, personal and money growth books, and books about how the world works. Self-made millionaires take time to study the trends, concepts, and financial news each day to become an expert in their field and stay up to date on what's current. They know that their relevance in their areas is mostly dependent on their continuous learning and adaptation. Little wonder why Albert Einstein said, when you stop learning, you start dying. 2. They are foresighted action takers. Even though everyone dreams, only a few individuals take further steps to turn those dreams into realities. Self-made millionaires take actionable steps towards the life they want. Self-made millionaires do not just set goals, they set realistic goals. They know what they want in their future selves, state the purposes and work towards achieving the things they desire. They look for any way practically possible to turn their visions into realities. Come to think of it, even if everyone can think of it, a goal to earn 100,000 this year seems daunting until you realize it is only a matter of making $8,300 each month, $1,922 each week, $273 each day, 10 clients who each spend $10,000, 20 clients who each contribute $5,000, or 50 clients who each pay $2,000. Those bite-sized chunks are much easier to swallow than the entire $100,000 pie, so there is a higher degree of motivation. Financial planner Scott D. Hedgecock once said, In my experience, the biggest difference between those on the right path, those on the wrong path, is the amount of time and effort they put into devising a plan for their finances. But creating a plan is one thing. Taking out time and effort to see it through is the only thing all financially successful people carry out. 3. They invest wisely. Self-made millionaires didn't become wealthy by only making and saving money. They became millionaires by strategically investing their money. After all, acquiring income from multiple income streams is another self-made millionaire habit that will never lead to wealth without the discipline to invest and watch the money grow. By investing in especially income-generating ideas and investment products, you slowly but inevitably become financially independent over time. Self-made millionaires safeguard their future with an emergency fund. They leave outside the constant worry of financial failure and save, invest, and eliminate unnecessary debt. Although many people have heard of George Clayson's key to business success, he stated in his book, The Richest Man in Babylon, Pay Yourself First, not everyone understands what that statement truly means. People assume that the term pay yourself first means taking out a portion of your income to save or spend on your wants as a form of reward. However, what Clayson means by pay yourself first is that you take out a portion, preferably 10% of your income before you spend on your needs and other things. The 10% is not supposed to be for wants but as a form of investment into other profitable ventures. Self-made millionaires practice and understand this. 4. Prioritize self-care Self-made millionaires know how important it is to stop, 
rest and recharge. No, they don't go on vacations or therapy just because they have the money to do so. Self-made millionaires, for them, know that for them to make more money, they continuously need to fuel their most precious assets, their mind and body. Not only can rest make you physically healthy and fit, but it also helps to restore your inner focus, increase your creativity and diminish the risk of burnout. Inasmuch as they enjoy working, self-made millionaires know that the speedy, ever-efficient and outpaced work has only one consequence, burnout. So they take time to take a break from their busy schedules. Then, self-care isn't just important. Your preservation, which extends to your financial freedom, depends on it. Health professionals typically recommend the average adult should get as many as seven hours of sleep every night. If we are honest though, most of us don't. Self-care allows you to take responsibility for your physical, emotional, psychological and social needs. In today's hurried modern society, slowing down is not attractive for many professionals. And that is why these self-made millionaires go on trips and long breaks. Eating good food, getting quality sleep, prioritizing exercise and keeping to the doctor's appointment are some of the ways through which self-made millionaires preserve their health. 5. Focus on value creation In the heart of every self-made millionaire lies the question, what unique insights or skills do I bring to the table that other people do not? In what way can I better the living condition of others? According to Canadian-American motivational public speaker and self-development author, all wealth comes from adding value, from producing more, better, cheaper, faster and easier than someone else. To become rich, you must add value. If you have a unique skill set or intelligence of a particular subject, you possess the capabilities to disrupt the existing industries. To disrupt the existing industry. While the multitude of people do not make use of their skill sets, self-made millionaires use their abilities to cause significant changes. To make money, you must alter the current paradigm and help or positively impact the lives of a large number of people. There are billions of people in the world and only a tiny fraction is self-made millionaires. These are the people who have created phenomenally successful businesses and changed the world in significant ways. The assumption that many people have about the rich is incorrect. Self-made millionaires place value creation above profit-making. When they create products and services, they put in their best because they understand that great value and strategy automatically equals enormous profit. The world doesn't throw a billion dollars at a person because the person wants it or work so hard they feel they deserve it. The world does not care what you want or deserve. The universe gives you money in exchange for something it perceives to be of equal or higher value, something that transforms an aspect of the culture, reworks a familiar story or introduces a new one, alters the way people think about the category and makes use of it in daily life. Self-made millionaires are not made by an event or chance. They are made by a process which is constituted by several habits and practices. Unfortunately, when people look at the rich, they tend to overlook these habits.